Hey everyone! Today I have um, something a bit different from the normal. It's not a tutorial or a door showcase. It is a showcase on this. You may be wondering what in the world is this? And that is a good question. It is a ticks per second calculator. It pretty much tells the player or um, makes it so that you can tell how fast the game is running. Now it has some simple mechanics and how this works is that when the game is slowed down, the only thing that remains constant is the game's player speed. Every single a other aspect of the game is slowed down. So in order to fix, and, and I really, really, really like to open up the console or F3 when I'm playing on Java, and I can't do that in Bedrock Edition. And sometimes I really want to know how slow the game is, and I want a, an actual number. So in order to fix this, I built this machine right here. Now how it works is that you sprint from one end to the other, and for every single one of these that you see, you pretty much add two to the amount of ticks per second. Um, you don't add two with this one. So for every single one after this one, so this one included and after, you add two. So right now they all extended and it means that we have our game running at a solid 20 ticks per second. But let's say we're under some laggy conditions or some crazy person has decided to build a lag machine. Now this is a very small one, it shouldn't affect the game too much. But let's see what it does anyways. Okay, so we're going to aim at the end and I put iron bars to make sure we're going as straight as possible. You start to run and right now it should be it, like I think only the last one shouldn't extend. No, we had two of them that didn't extend which means that we're going at either 16 or 17 ticks per second right now. So go ahead and reset this. And if we want some even lagger conditions, we can just go ahead and add more. Um, let's add even more. Just do this. And I have split controls turned on right now because um, it's obviously to aim at the end. Now we are playing under some really laggy conditions because someone built, I don't know, a quarry or something. And now if we go ahead and run, we can see that even less blocks managed to get extended, which means the game is running even slower. Here we had one, two, three, four, five, which means that the game is running at half speed or maybe even a tiny bit over half speed, which is still playable if you ask me. Um, like, let's look at some of our doors. For example, um, here, this. This is the closest thing. We can see. You know, it works fine. Um, it's kind of playable, really. The opening, you know, you can tell what's going on. It's not like in some worlds, <laughs> my um, my display world, <laughs> where it's unbearably slow. But anyways, I, I just want to show you guys my quick solution to the lack of um, of an F or of, of the equivalent of the F three screen in Pocket Edition. So that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all next time. Bye!